guys happy saturday sorry i've been so behind i just haven't had any lack of motivation i know my hair looks crazy just woke up from a nap so excuse that i was going to show you guys my cute outfit right now at least this is the roommate lounge outfit so i'm hoping it's not too see-through but the top is from amazon so like what do you expect to put on here my shirt is from amazon it's this like strappy tank and it has a race rack but good and cropped and then these are actually boy shorts from skims i like to wear them in the summer just so then i don't have to wear like pants and extra stuff but obviously if i go out see it's a little bit see-through but if you get other colors like the black and the navy it's not too bad and this is no support because it's just like a lounge tank top and the back is just the race rack which is really nice and this is a con, and I get a size small. So, yeah. And look at how cute this freaking mug. It is, if you look closely, I don't know if it will zoom in. It's a bear. I don't know if you can see the freaking um, eyes. It's like a bear shaping. And it's a glass mug. I was actually gonna, maybe I'll put my light on so you guys can fully compare. I just haven't opened up my lights, so I have to go wash my face. I just came back from work and then rested and relaxed. I was really tired. So we are going to compare two fanny packs and see which is... Obviously, I'm going to keep both because I'm a huge, like, bag collector. But if I were to choose one or the other, which one would I choose? So, just recently, I've been going on, like, dog walks a lot. So wearing my, you know, name brand isn't the best because it's like gonna get dirty easy. So I bought this one, not from the real Isle store. This is from Poshmark. Or you can get something similar. This is the Sherpa bag. I don't know that I would wear this necessarily because this is gonna get dirty fast. And then this was actually cheaper and in really good condition. You just have to be careful buying off Poshmark because sometimes they do sell fakes and sometimes the pictures are edited. So it comes, this was like $50 off and it was really expensive on the website. Which I feel like, I don't know. Front packet. And then we have another packet. I also wish like it had like a logo inside here that says aloe. I don't know why it doesn't. I'm not sure if it's a little out of Poshmark or why. And you have another zipper in the inside and then you have another section in the back so this is really nice really soft i feel like you can fit a lot it's sort to how you could wear it you can well maybe not wear it with this shirt I, if i was going out i'd probably wear like a sports bra and an athletic like sweater or workout tank something like that so you put on like this and it's in the front like that or if you don't like it in the front i think you could make a crossbody possibly possibly could make it a crossbody like right here like that but i don't usually like that because that's gonna like hurt my you know chest area too much but this is a good way and i like that if it's right in the front nobody will like pocket you and everything because sometimes when your bag is on the side and everything and it comes with this metal and it's adjustable, of course. It's really nice. Very cute. I'm probably going to wear this as, like, a winter bag, honestly. And then I actually have one more that is really similar. I don't know if I've shown you guys this. But this I got off eBay, actually. Sometimes you can actually get some cheap on eBay. This is from MZ Wallace. This is a lot smaller, though. MZ Wallace. It's a collaboration with a super group. But I do like that it came with the logo. It's nice. This one's a lot smaller though. With one front pouch. Super small. So like better not be going anywhere. And then another picture. And then just comes the back. MZ Wallace. And it comes with gold. Strapping. This was 75 I think. So a little bit more expensive than the aloe. But I think it's because... This is like a braided feeling. That one's more of like a shirt feeling. 
And then the next one I have, I, I this will be my go-to because this is like literally 30 bucks and it's from Lulu. This is their everywhere something belt bag, I don't know. Definitely a different material for the class. This, those ones are like miles. These one is like a plastic and the strap is definitely, I think the same. The straps are the same. This is more like a plastic feel though. And I got this for 30 because it was on clearance. And I actually have a gift card because I bought a bunch of stuff on there. Like, I think it was their anniversary or something like that. And they had like 70% and I went crazy and I bought a lot of stuff that I didn't like. And now they only do store credit if you buy it on sale, which I'm like, it's okay. But I would like my money back, but it's fine. It, it, I'm still using it, so. And this is actually unisex, woman and man who wear it. Whereas those other ones are more feminine. <laughs> Only one pouch, though. But it looks pretty big, so you can be filling all other stuff. But Or I go out and I just use my water well bag, because these ones you can't really go out. I'm not sure if they have water. I know aloe definitely does not have water well bag. I'm not sure if blue lemon does. I'm not quite sure. And this is waterproof, which is really nice, too. So if I ever got it wet, it'd be nice. But it's still decently big. It's way bigger than the other ones. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As for things I would usually bring, obviously a charger and my wallet and my phone and sunglasses. I feel like most bags, after two items, you cannot fit that much because, like, you fit your glasses. Your glasses have to fit in the case, too, so... I hope you guys enjoy this video. Have a great day. Bye-bye. And happy Memorial Day before I forget.